What is up everyone, this is Mogam here and today I'm going to show you how to fix the PlayStation 5 error checking for save data on cloud storage. Uh, this is when you're basically either trying to turn on a game or is just trying to like get the cloud data for your software, game, app, whatever, and it's just stuck and you're like, what is going on? How do I fix this? What am I doing wrong? <laughs> so this happened to me a few times also and there's, there's a couple of ways to fix it. So first and foremost what you want to do is restart your playstation 5 this actually ends up fixing the issue there's usually just like a server issue or a software issue that's occurring causing this to happen uh so you want to just kind of rule that option out the next one is if you want to depending on what it is if it's something like youtube or something it's fairly easy to do you can actually delete the app and reinstall it back in because again it's related to like a network or software type issue causing this to happen. If it's a game, I would say go to the next step first before doing this one. But doing that does help fix this issue per se. Uh, the other thing that you can do is because you don't want to kind of turn off your uh, cloud storage. You could go into your save data and essentially turn off cloud storage, this, this save data sinkage and whatnot. Uh, so it's kind of up to you if you want to do that or not. I wouldn't advise to do that. It's essentially it's going to kind of like throw it off from your side because if you especially have games in the cloud and you know that's the whole point why you have playstation plus right because you want to have that cloud storage so the way you can essentially fix this is you want to go to network and under network you want to go to settings in here you want to do setup internet connection settings so a lot of the times it's usually due to network issues that this error is occurring so what you want to do is you want to go first you can try a couple of things you want to click into the option button and you want to change or play around with the wi-fi frequency band you want to see which one works best for you either automatic the 5 gigahertz or 2.4 uh once trying that uh, assuming this still doesn't fix the issue and even if it does you want to kind of go the next step is you want to go into the dns settings uh you can keep everything else okay but you want to change dns into manual and you want to change primary into 8.8.8.8 and secondary into 8.8.4.4 uh once you do that you can just press okay it'll essentially just say connecting to the access point it'll successfully connect and then whenever you're trying to turn on the application or game you should not get that error persist any longer uh good rule of thumb restart your playstation 5 just to get a like final reboot in it and then you guys should be good to go and not get this error persist any longer uh, so yeah, <laughs> that's basically it. Uh, if you guys overall like this video, please smash that like button. Also, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to subscribe and click that notification bell. And that, we out.